Hey everybody, it's Rebecca. I'm going to be unboxing this, which is from, what do they call that store? Drill Pen Frenzy. This is something people have been telling me to get forever. And I've been putting it off and I'm like, eh. So I finally got one and you can probably guess what it is. But look, it's in a pink bag. I love it. And then friend mail from my friend who is, by now, she has has, had to have cleaned out all of her yarn. Um, she keeps uh, gifting me with her yarn stash and I'm loving it. So we're gonna see what we got from Donnie first. I feel my heart breaks for Tesla. My goodness, they were all planned to go to Disney and Disney World closed. Disneyland closed. I don't know which one they were going to. Disneyland, I think. Or one of the parks. All the theme parks are closed. Everything's closed. <sighs> Day seven of house arrest or incarceration or whatever. I did get to go out today. Went to the mail. Uh, to, went to mail a package. I mailed a diamond painting, one of my diamond art clubs, to a friend because she's running out of diamond paintings. And... She keeps running to Walmart to get diamond painting. I thought, good Lord, I have a diamond art club. I'll give it to you. So, I'm sorry. Coffee sip. So, um, yeah. So, that's anyway. So, Donnie, I felt really bad for her um, having to cancel her vacation. But I might get her on the show. We'll see. I've been trying. She was heartbroken over that. But, um... When I watched your video about it, I said, you know, this is a good time to place that order that you keep putting off. Everybody keeps telling you to do it and you keep putting it off and putting it off. So that's when I did it. I think Donnie was saying the store was kind of dead because everybody thought they were on, she was on vacation. So I gave her some business. And my goodness, she wraps things very well. Uh, wow. <laughs> okay. We're going to get into this thing. And it is not a pen, guys. I I get pretty pretty much all my pens right now from Crashly. Uh, so let's see what did we get from Donnie. Now, oh my God, I still got to get into the box. So there is a piece of paper here. Let me just see what it says. It's an invoice. Thank you for ordering and for choosing to support the home of the original cover minder. Well, there you go. Jim and Donnie Hogan. Nice. And they are in Junction City, Oregon. If you um, want to check out, uh, they have an Etsy store, drillpenfrenzy.etsy.com. And I will link that in the description of this video. And she's got a whole lot of stuff, like pages and pages. I don't know, 13, 14 pages of stuff to look through. Lots of cover minders, um, pens, you know, doodads like this. I don't know, I call them doodads. All right, we are still not into it. It's a box in a box. Goodness gracious, we're still not into it. She was going to make darn sure that this thing got to me in one piece. Donnie, good job. Or Jim, whichever one of you packaged this. Okay, we're almost there. Now we still have a box. <laughs> and a bag. Okay, if you guys don't know what this is, it is, it's a ladybug, sorry for all the noise, vacuum. Now, do I need to put a battery in here? Let me see. Oh, um, it's, okay, wait a minute, hold on. Push. Push? Is that, what does that do? Oh, okay, I, What? Oh no, that gives you the drills, so where, okay, so the drills go into there, do I need, 
It's not doing anything. I need, I'm sure I need to put batteries, but where? Help. Okay. Who knows how to work this thing? <laughs> okay. That's, the, that's gotta be the on off switch. This has gotta be the, you get the drills out switch. Uh oh, hold on. Please don't tell me I'm breaking this thing. I'm just looking inside, but I don't see a place. This is like the filter of the vacuum. So let's put that back in place. I don't want to break it. Oh my God, leave it to me to break something. Okay, that's in place. See, this is the bottom. There's no place where batteries there and then it has these little brushes on the bottom which is kind of cool for a little vacuum that snaps back on but I don't see where you put the battery it's so cute I got green there was on one other color I think I don't remember but I chose this one anyway um, maybe it has directions let's see it's Chinese. Model, purpose, operation, precautions. Okay, there is a place for batteries, but where? Oh, there says open, close somewhere. Wait a minute. Where does it say open and close? Oh, ha oh, oh, ha, look at that. Oh. Ta-da! I got the top off. <laughs> now I need... It doesn't say what size. Insert the battery. Double A battery. Two double A's. Okay. I'm going to pause and go get two double A batteries. Okay. I'm back. Let's put the batteries in. They go in... Okay, that's positive. Goes that way. I have them in the freezer. I don't know why. I always just, I keep my batteries in the freezer. I always have. I don't know if that's good or bad, but at least I know where to find them. I, I do need to buy some more batteries, too. Hold on. These little suckers don't want to go in. There. They're in. Now, let's see. All right. I suppose I need to put some drills here. Just, we're going to try this out. Okay, we'll put that over there. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. We're going to spill some drills. Okay. All right, I don't think it moves by itself. Look at that. Sometimes I get drills down here. Okay, off. Now, ooh, let's look. Let's look. Push, push. <laughs> and there they are. They're in there. See them? The little gray ones. That's kind of cool. Well, they're all falling out, but that's very cool. I have a vacuum for the drills. Okay, we're going to put them back in there. Oh, that is one logistic solved in my diamond painting world. And it's too cute, isn't it? Uh, I've spent far too long on this vacuum. <laughs> the ladybug vacuum. Okay. Fun mail. There's no vacuums, no batteries needed, I'm sure, in this pocket. And I love, love, love this person. My goodness, she is so good to me. Let's see what she sent. Oh, goodness. I don't want to, because there's. I'm sure it's got yarn involved, so I'm trying not to cut the yarn.
Oh, look at this. Ooh, red and white. I love it. Lion brand. Um, oh, it's super bulky. I like super bulky yarn. Um, for winter, gotta, this is make a great hat. Need another hat. <gasps> Look at this color. Oh my God. Purple, green, and blue. It's called Kaleidoscope. <gasps> so pretty. Pattern included for a hat, I hope. This color is called Zircon, and it is also super bulky. Yay. Oh, look at this color. Got some of my favorite colors in it. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, my God. Now, I don't think this one is as heavy. This is Jewel is the name of the colors. Lion Brand five bulky these are six bulky the higher the number the bulkier they are so this is five and, ooh, no she did not oh my god she sent me a shawl guys it's gorgeous look at this she does extraordinary work look at the craftsmanship of this shawl Guys, oh my god, it's beautiful. Can you see that? And the colors? Now I think she used one of these yarn type yarns for to make this. This is super bulky. Oh, so gorgeous. And it is so cold out today. I'm gonna put it on. Okay. Ooh. Very nice. Okay, I'm covered. Oh, ooh, that feels good. <laughs> And this last thing, she um, she knows I have my granddaughter for the week. So she sent this for my granddaughter. It's from KB, which is Knitting Board. And it's a 32-peg loom, knit hook, and instructions. So my I can teach my granddaughter some more loom knitting. She's on her second hat. So cool. I haven't taught her the, 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 what's the rib stitch yet. Um, she's just doing the E-stitch, but she might be able to just do the E-stitch with this. I'm not sure. Let's see the instructions. Um, yeah, this would be the rib stitch, but she's very intelligent. Um. We will figure that out for her. And then I'll give her this that has the instructions for the rib stitch. Hopefully it, because she's going home today. She's coming back in a week. It does tell you how to bind off. It also gives her a stockinette, or it gives her the rib stitch and a stockinette stitch. She could use either one to um, make a scarf I suppose so I'm gonna let her choose one of these yarns actually no I'm not <laughs> I'm <laughs> I want to keep these two I like them she's already got some yarn okay she's work she's and my my um, my daughter asked my granddaughter to knit her a hat and she's picked out the yarn for that as well so anyway this will be for my granddaughter uh, when she comes back next week because today she's going home and she'll go home with what she the she's working on a round loom right now so i'm sure she'll go home with that oh my god thank you thank you look at all this yarn oh my god i love it and my vacuum for the drills i am all set guys i'm getting ready to kit up another painting for my live tonight saturday night live with rebecca special guest look at my thumbnail to see who the special guest is i have one every week and um even if it's a creator that you know i guarantee you i'm gonna get into some things you may not know about that creator and um i hope you'll join me so thanks everybody take care